Hey everybody, it's Emily the Crazy Worm Lady. I'm here today with the European Night Crawlers. If you recall, we harvested them last week and I was working on a little project the other day. I had some extra coconut core, so I did add that to this bin. And as you can see, these guys are looking good. They seem to be right up near the surface, which I didn't really expect. Oh, I feel some of those potatoes breaking apart as I hit them down here. Not a lot happening to them yet, but um, they are soft, so I'll take that as a good sign. It smells a little, little funky, though, I'll tell you that. That makes me just a little bit concerned because it's a much stronger smell than I'm used to, especially for something like a potato. Um, but I'm just going to mix this up real well, make sure all of our worms look okay. And we might not feed today and just add a little bit of buffer. Could probably use a hair moisture as well. And then just let these guys go at it for another week. But, so far, so good. Worms are definitely all throughout here. Ugh, my hand just went through a potato. That was rather gross. So this potato down here, in this corner, is definitely breaking down. My finger went through it. And I think that's what's smelling, surprisingly. I think it's these potatoes breaking down. Whew, that is foul. Um, the good news is all these worms in here look great. And I'm sure they're enjoying this feeding. It's just, uh, it was maybe a little bit too much for them just because it's a slower breaking down food. But I'm going to lay this all out nice and relatively flat across the surface, make sure all of that stuff in the bottom is covered up and the smell is gone as soon as I bury it all back up, but it is rather, rather strong smelling. So I'm going to add a whole bunch of eggshell. I always think it's a good way to go if you're concerned about any sort of acidity issues. And I do have a spray bottle here, and I'm just gonna, oh, didn't really want it set on such a sharp spray there, but I'll spray along the edges here. It's noisy, I'll finish that after I turn off the camera. But um, I'll probably lay a little bit more dry bedding across the top here. Um, in my mind, you can't go wrong with more bedding, more buffer, all of that will be helpful. And I'll moisten it down a little bit, and we will let them go for another week. So, let me know what you think. Drop those comments below. Like this video, subscribe if you'd like some more content from me, and I'll be back with you guys next week for an update.